the untold, the girlfriend who didn't exist, which is the Netflix docu series, giving an inside look at the shocking 2013 reveal that Manti Teo's dead girlfriend never existed. Uh, and it's going to take you on a journey that covers all of the bases. How this catfishing happened, why it happened, and how it got exposed. How the scandal hurt Teo's career, uh, the toll that it took on him, on and off the field, and a lot more. Now, as far as I can tell, it's only two episodes, like a two-part series. I watched the first one, the first episode last night. I'm setting up to watch the second one tonight. It is wild. Like, there is so much stuff. First off, it's fun to, like, revisit the things from back then, almost 10 years ago. So that's fun. But there are certain things in there that I, th like, I thought I knew a lot about what was going on. Like, I, I didn't remember that. Like, I remember she died. But I don't remember that there was, like, the, the catfish guy who is now transgender, transitioned to a woman... I, f I forget the names. There's so many names, and they're all Polynesian names. It's very difficult to keep tabs on it. Uh, but I believe, uh, like, uh, he, the, the guy who was a guy at the time uh, that was the catfisher felt left out, felt, felt alone, so then brought back the dead girlfriend and started texting Teo that, like, it's me, it's me, like, I'm back. It's like, it's very weird and trippy. So I'm really looking forward to the second uh, episode. Highly, highly recommend everybody take a look at it.